Hi, welcome to this Focal Live station. I'm Wei Jean, a product manager for Home Audio and Custom Install Division, and I'm really happy to introduce to you today our new line for Custom Install. At Focal, the Custom Install Division is really important. It regroups all the products that you can install in your wall and in the ceiling. For the moment, we have two different lines, 100 series and 300 series. In those two lines, you will have in-ceiling product, in-wall product, and even outdoor product. That allows you to have a beautiful song in all your house and even outside. But today we want to go further. Further in terms of sound, of course, it's a part of focal DNA, but also in terms of possibilities. We need to match two different needs. An easy installation, quick and discreet, and also a beautiful sound. That's why today I'm really excited to introduce to you our new line, 1000 series. 1000 series is composed of seven different products with our high-end technology, the W membrane and the beryllium tweeter. It's almost the same technology that we have in Sopra and in Utopia line. Seven products? Yes, but two are really, really special. So stay until the end of this video and you will have some surprise. So let's start with in-selling product. The first one is ICW6. ICW6 is a six inch in-selling speaker with beryllium tweeter, W membrane. As I say, it's our flagship technology. As you can see, we have a special design. We call that technology Easy Quick Install because it's allowed the integrator to put the product in the ceiling without any tool and it's amazing. The next product is brand new at Focal. We call it ICA6 for in-selling angle seizing speaker. As you can see, we have a special design with a 35 degree angle that match perfectly with our Dolby Atmos specification. And thanks to this product, you can cover a huge listening area that will allow you to put some product on the corner of your room to be first really discreet and to fill the room with amazing sound. The next product is ICLCR5. ICLCR5 is a three-way bass reflex loudspeaker with one tweeter, one medium, and two woofers. With this special design, this allows you to have the sensation that the sound comes from the horizontal plane and not above your head. That is perfect for surround effect or atmos effect. But as you can see, here, the medium tweeter part can rotate to adjust perfectly to the listening position. And this is also perfect for left, center, and right channel for your home theater. Like the other in-selling product, you also have the Easy Quick Install. But one more thing, as the design and the dimension of those products are exactly the same than the 300 series, you will be able to upgrade your system from 300 series to 1000 series. And believe me, you're gonna feel the difference. We have also ready to paint grill to match perfectly with your ceiling, to be well integrated, discreet, and with an amazing song. And now, let's have a look to in-wall products. The 
The first one is small and compact. It's AW6. It's a close back two-way loudspeaker with one beryllium tweeter and one W membrane for woofer and medium. It's really important in that product to be close back because as it is our high end range, we need to control perfectly our acoustic volume to manage perfectly our performance. You have also on that product a rotative tweeter that allows you to adjust the listening position perfectly. The second in-wall product is IWLCR6. It's a three-way close-back loudspeaker with one tweeter, one medium, one woofer, and a passive radiator that will bring you more powerful in terms of bass. You will have on that product an amazing medium tweeter plate that can rotate to allow you to have the speaker vertically and horizontally. This is perfect for left, center, and right channel. And of course, we have a mechanical part that can rotate again to adjust exactly to the listening position. To fit with your constraints in the wall, we have less than 10 cm depth for all those two products. And also, we have rotative parts to exactly adjust to the listening position. So I let Olivier, our mechanic specialist, to introduce you all the challenge that he had during the development of the project. Merci Régent. Sur ce projet, je suis le chargé de développement mécanique. Mon rôle a été de concevoir les pièces en fonction des cahiers des charges acoustiques, marketing, mais aussi des contraintes industrielles que nous avons eues. En plus de la partie mécanique du projet, j'ai aussi eu le rôle de chargé de projet de la gamme. Sur ce projet, nous avions deux contraintes majeures. Une contrainte pour les intégrateurs, de manière à leur simplifier toute l'utilisation, toute l'installation des produits. Et bien sûr, nous devions conserver le son focal. Les solutions que nous avons développées pour, euh, pour simplifier l'utilisation, euh, nous avons fait par exemple le Easy Quick Install euh, que nous avions déjà développé sur la, sur la gamme précédente. Le Easy Quick Install va vous permettre d'installer vos produits d'une manière très simple. Surtout, il va vous permettre d'avoir les mains libres, d'utiliser vos mains uniquement pour installer les produits dans les plafonds ou dans les murs et de ne pas avoir à utiliser d'outils pour venir fixer le tout. Et au niveau du gain de temps pour l'installateur, c'est vraiment très important. Nous avons développé un tout nouveau produit dans les inselling, la 1000 ICA6. Pour ce produit, nous avions beaucoup de contraintes mécaniques à, à régler puisque nous avons installé un haut-parleur euh, avec un angle de 35 degrés à l'intérieur d'un cadre de 8 pouces. Euh, ce produit va vous permettre de faire du Dolby Atmos. Au niveau de la conception, nous avons cherché des solutions pour qu'au niveau de l'installation, ça devienne facile, ça devienne simple. Euh, pour ça, nous avons développé donc, par exemple des tweeters euh, rotatifs avec des, des solutions euh, bien travaillées qui nous ont pris du temps, qui ont demandé aussi pas mal de, pas mal de prototypes pour qu'au final, l'installateur puisse euh, utiliser, puisse régler les produits facilement. Comme par exemple pour la réalisation du tweeter rotatif de la IW6, nous avons dû réaliser beaucoup de prototypes pour euh, pouvoir arriver à une pièce finie euh, qui donne un rendu simple à utiliser, qui soit à la fois souple mais qui reste en place de manière à ne pas ajouter des bruits parasites dans, dans l'enceinte. Euh, pour ce faire, nous avons aussi une imprimante 3D et c'est avec celle-ci que nous avons réalisé beaucoup de prototypes. Ce tweeter a l'avantage de pouvoir être orienté aussi bien en haut, en bas et ça va permettre donc à l'installateur de bien positionner son enceinte, de bien positionner le tweeter par rapport à la zone d'écoute. Au niveau des matériaux, surtout au niveau du toucher, euh, nous avons utilisé de l'aluminium de manière à avoir vraiment un super toucher, un super rendu euh, quand on vient à manipuler ces pièces. Ce qui a été plutôt contraignant dans ce projet, mais aussi très intéressant, c'est développer des haut-parleurs dans un faible volume. Ça nous a donné beaucoup de contraintes au niveau du développement des haut-parleurs, mais au final, nous avons un super rendu. 
Ces haut-parleurs sont beaucoup plus puissants pour pouvoir fonctionner dans ces faibles volumes. Ils ont des bobines et des impédances beaucoup plus hautes, des membranes plus lourdes, et c'est ce qui a été assez compliqué à développer. Au niveau de la puissance que ces enceintes ont dégagée, il a fallu faire en sorte que les grilles soient bien fixées sur les enceintes. Le taux d'ouverture des grilles a été choisi pour, les, pour rendre le son totalement clair, que les grilles soient totalement transparentes vis-à-vis -vis du son, et elles peuvent être peintes pour aller dans tous les intérieurs. Au niveau des contraintes sur ce projet, nous avons aussi développé des produits de grande taille avec des poids importants. Ces produits vont pouvoir même s'assembler ensemble, mais ça, c'est Régent qui va vous en parler. Thank you Olivier for all those details. It's really interesting. And now, as I told you, we have a surprise. So I'll let you with Nicolas for more details. Thank you Régent. Hi, my name is Nicolas. Uh, I'm in charge of the Focal and Name product training team as well as a CI product specialist in the meantime. Today we're going to unveil you a brand new product and solution consisting uh, of two products, Utopia and Subutopia. It took us more than three years of research and development to bring this concept live and now let's have a more detailed focus on those products all together. Focal is recognized all over the world for the flagship series and approach with Utopia product. On the home classic side, Utopia is famous with Scala, Maestro, Stella and Grande Utopia EM Evo. Today the idea is to bring those solutions in wall and on wall as well thanks to two products, 1000 IW Utopia LCR and 1000 IW Sub. So let's start with the 1000 IW LCR Utopia. This product is a close back design composed of several drivers. To start with, we have four base drivers, 6.5 inches each, two mids of 3 inches and a pure beryllium inverted dome tweeter at the middle of the product. By the way, this is the very same tweeter than the one we use in the Grande Utopia EM Evo. Here, the idea with this concept is to reach both very high sound quality plus high SPL potential in the same time. On top of the in-wall speaker, we also have the dedicated subwoofer module. The ID here is based on 3 times 6.5 inches base driver to offer either a dedicated subwoofer channel as an LFE for the home theater application, as well as an enhancement of the Utopia speaker. When it comes to the Utopia speaker, you can basically scale the system depending on the room size. If you want a setup with one speaker only, very easy to do. You want an even bigger system with more sound pressure level as well as frequency response extension, you can easily connect one subwoofer module at the top or the bottom of the Utopia speaker. To do so, you have speaker connectors on the top and at the bottom of the product and we provide speaker cables inside the packaging. That way you end up starting from the amplifier output, connecting the speaker connectors on top of the Utopia product, then another speaker cable to connect the Utopia speaker to the first subwoofer module, second subwoofer module you go from the bottom connectors of the first sub to the second input and so on and so forth. The limit of the system in such a configuration is one Utopia up to six subwoofer modules. As an example, in the Focal Grant Auditorium today, the setup we have here consists in one Utopia speaker as the front left speaker and two subwoofer modules, one on top, one at the bottom for the left, right and center channel as well. The idea now, based on again the room design and room acoustics, is to offer the very best of sound performances by design. This is the reason why we have several adjustments on the front panels. To start with, on the Utopia speaker, you see four different switches. The very first one on top is here to ensure the high frequency level shelving possibilities consisting in minus 3, 0 and plus 3 dB possibilities. The second one here is dedicated to the mid-range. Here you will act on plus, minus 2 dBs and 0 dB obviously. And the third one here is the one for the mid-base drivers where you can adjust from minus 3, 0 and plus 3 dB as well. 
The last one here is basically the crossover that is in charge of the subwoofer module. This one is here to select the cutoff frequency of the sub, where you can choose between three possibilities, 80 Hz, 100 and 120 Hz. This is a critical point because here, by design, you optimize the integration of the subwoofer module depending on the room acoustics and room size in the meantime. The Utopia in-wall LCR is dedicated as left center and right channel, as you understood from the name. One good example is by design, you have the tweeter and mid in the middle of the product that ensure both left, right and center compatibility. As a center channel, you can also position the speaker slightly lower to the screen and then benefit from the angling possibilities of the tweeter and mids here up or down for the center channel configuration. That way you end up matching the sweet spot of the room by design of the speaker. On top of that, depending on the configuration of the system, you might will to complement the speaker along with one or more subwoofer modules. The subwoofer modules feature some impedance selectors at the back. Here the idea is to select between two values 8 ohms and 72 ohms. When you use the subwoofer along with Utopia, select 8 ohms for configuration like one Utopia, one sub, or one Utopia up to two subwoofer modules. Then switch to 72 ohms if you use more than two subwoofers along with the Utopia product. For the dedicated use of subwoofer as an LFE channel, you have the very same possibility. Subwoofer only, you can keep the 8 ohm value up to 4 subwoofers. In that case, the minimum impedance will be about 2.2 ohms, which is very easy to drive for most of the amplifiers nowadays. And thanks to this configuration, you end up with unlimited possibilities. One key point here also consists in key benefits, which is the ease of integration. Those two products, even if they offer stunning performances, super high SPL capabilities, are less than 10 cm thick, which means that you can easily install those in regular drywall by design without the requirement of rebuilding the entire room, which is a very cost-effective solution and also to maintain the interior design of the room while offering more applications such as let's turn our living room in a home theater while keeping something very consistent in regards to interior design. Then here in order to bring the very best of acoustic performances you can also benefit from having multiple subs all across the room to end up with even better room modes and a much better bass response all across the room as an example for the first, second and third rows where usually in most of the case with other types of product you will have one perfect sweet spot, the other will lack a bit of bass. With this module and this concept you are sure that you will benefit from the very best wherever you are in the room. Using the subwoofer module only as a low frequency effect channel allows you to basically dedicate the system and scale the system depending on the room size. You might use one module, two modules, three modules, four modules and so on on the front right corner and left corner as an example. Up to four subwoofer modules connected on the same amplifier output you will keep the 8 ohm impedance. More than four subs on the same amplifier output, you will have to switch to the 72 ohms impedance value. When you have four subwoofers connected together, the minimum impedance is 2.2 ohms, which is very easy to drive for most of the amplifiers nowadays. The 1000 series, such as the 1000 IW, Utopia and 1000 IW sub have been fine-tuned and developed along with our focal and name electronic solutions. 
on the home theater side, those two products have been optimized by design to work along with Astral 16, our very high-end AV receiver and sound processor in the same time. In this configuration now in our grand auditorium, we are basically using three front LCR consisting in one Utopia, two subwoofer modules per channel, one Utopia, one subwoofer module for the sides and one Utopia, one subwoofer module for the rears as well, along with four 1000 IC LCR5 as Atmos speakers, all of those being powered by Astral 16. And you can reach both very high SPL and benefit from the very best sound quality by design. The other benefits thanks to Astral 16 and the possibility of LFE management consist in also sending some LFE signal to all of those speakers in order to benefit from the very best bass experience whatever the rows of seats you are in. On the music side background music or music diffusion, those products have also been fine-tuned along with name electronics. Be it on the NAP series like NAP 300DR, NAP 500DR, Statement as well, those products ensure the very best of music performances, again in-wall and on-wall integrated. Thank you Nicolas for those details. I'm sure that you're gonna love this 1000 series. And now I invite you in shops to discover this fabulous experience.